Welcome to Good Mythical More. Which soda pairs best with the Big Mac? What better way to get summer started than giving some money, a thousand dollars to the NAACP Legal Defense Fund, Legal Defense and Educational Fund to aid in their mission to fight for racial justice through litigation, advocacy, and public education. Join us in giving at NAACPLDF.org slash donate. Thank you for being your mythical best and for starting Good Mythical Summer along with us. Now at the top of the show, we didn't say Good Mythical Summer, we said Good Mythical Morning. We, we actually talked a lot about whether we were gonna right say- Right up until the moment that we good recorded. Good Mythical Summer um, this summer. We decided not to. We're gonna say Good Mythical Morning. And the reason we're doing that is because the year has been so crazy, and we usually, Good Mythical Summer is usually a sign that we're doing the show differently. Again, three times a week, there's a guest host, but we kind of did the weird three times a week thing because of COVID earlier. Yeah, so yeah, now yeah. we're doing, we're trying to bring some normalcy back to the show and hopefully to your life. So we were just like, you know what? Let's just go with Good Mythical Morning this summer. I don't know that you could apply the word normal to anything <laughs> we ever do, but. Right, you know, semi-normalcy. It is, it is a good mythical summer. Um, and not only is this show back, but Ear Biscuits is back. We took, a, we took a conversational break, but we're moving at the speed of conversation over there wherever podcasts are found. Uh, if you wanna keep up with how we're experiencing our summers personally and interpersonally. Personally and interpersonally. Uh, That's almost what we called it. Listen to Ear Biscuits, okay? Uh, Link, here's a Big Mac for you. Thank you. There's nothing you, else I are you want hungry? more than another Big Mac. Uh, so we're gonna go through all the it's sodas. It looks so little now compared to all of those creations. We're gonna go through all the sodas that uh, McDonald's offers and see which one you should get along with your Big Mac. Because listen, that's something that everybody needs to know. Because uh, remember, our tongues make decisions for your tongue. <laughs> Is that how this works? Mm. I, I'm gonna sh I'm gonna shore up my. You want to get it perfect. My, my Big Mac, just to. I gotta say, the Big Mac is the right size. Okay, I'm just gonna take one bite. I'm taking a small bite, just so I can kind of. I think to make my way through this. I think the first time the Big Mac was pitched or prototyped, and they put that other bun in the middle, or if it was discussed, if it was pitched like, in in theory but not in prototype, you're like, oh, that doesn't sound like a good idea. But it's, it does something. It really spaces out the things that matter. You, that matter with some, I mean, it, it matters because of how it contributes to the overall effect. Mm. But you wouldn't think that it mattered as much as it does. Like, I just wanna, I just wanna give some appreciation to the unloved middle bun. Where are we starting? Start with Sprite, because this is a special Sprite. Special Sprite? Yeah, that's a special, what flavor is that? Tropic Berry. Tropic, Tropic Berry Sprite. So I'm just starting with the regular Sprite. And I gotta say, Sprite and a burger, it's good. It's a good combo. I typically don't get Sprite. You get Sprite? No. My, my kids will get Sprite because I say, well you can't, you gotta pick one without the caffeine. Mm, Sprite. Okay. The special sauce works with the lime bite. Plays well with the pickle. Oh, so you're actually putting it in your mouth, chewing and then drinking at the same time. Well, do it how you do it. Uh, well, I'm not commenting on it. I'm asking, I'm clarifying. Is that what's happening? That's what I did, yeah. Because I typically don't eat that way. Um, me neither. <laughs> I don't like Dr. So I'm pepper. not gonna start now. Maybe the maybe. Oh, what about this this one? Oh, you want to go with that next? Yeah, there, there, yeah. We want a sprite, then cr crazy sprite. Crazy sprite. Tropical berry. Ooh. Tastes like uh, strawberry Fanta. Is that a thing? Uh, there. I don't know. Sprite cranberry. That's a thing. That's my LeBron James impersonation. Oh, that's really good. Sprite cranberry. Um, Remember that commercial? No, I don't. <laughs> uh, every Christmas, LeBron's like Sprite cranberry. Every Christmas, I, I maybe only on, maybe on your local television. Yeah, I think. Local did I not say on my own to, local television? To your house. You know, on the Neil television, 
LeBron shows up. Now, it's a sport career bird. I'm a big fan of Dr. Pepper. We already know that. I don't like it at all. Maybe I'll like it more. That'll be the that that's the real test. Take a little big Mac bite. You know what? You take a little drink, a little sprite. 1885. You know how many different flavors it has? There's no way that it has 23 flavors. Like 23 flavors of what? You got a little flavor saved right there. But 23 flavors of what? You tell me. 23 different flavors. What, what, what kind of flavors? Like if you were to show me the flavors and take them to the root flavor? Um, I don't believe it. Medicine flavor? Yeah, right, Do that's doctor, most of it. Doctor piss flavor, pharmacist piss flavor. Those are three. There's no way there's 23 flavors in there. It's a lie. There's not even 23 ingredients. Licorice? I mean, it says natural and artificial flavors. I guess they wouldn't lie. <clears throat> licorice is a flavor. Pharmacist licorice, doctor's licorice. I like Dr. Pepper a lot, but I don't it made it typically better. get it with food. I get it like if I'm on a road trip and somebody's going into a curb store, as my dad calls it, which is another word for convenience store. You want something to drink? I'm like, yeah, now that you ask, yes. Die, Dr. Pepper, please. That's what I say. And I always say, please, because I'm kind. You ever had a diet Mellow Yellow? Yeah. As obsessed as we were with Mellow Yellow, why did we never get into Diet Mellow Yellow when it, we thought that would be a better because idea? Because it was not served in many places. I don't remember ever I mean, seeing it anywhere. It wasn't is it, is in, it in a, stores. Is it in a curb store? When I drink an orange drink, it takes me back to T-Ball. Yeah. Like, you know, I mean, this is kids' fair to me, man. You know, you got... You can't hit a ball without it being on a pedestal. Do you remember how it used to work in T-ball? Like, not T-ball, but the next step up from T-ball? The coach would pitch the ball to you. And then if you couldn't hit it after three tries, they brought out the tee. And that was the most humiliating thing. It's like, of course I can hit it off a tee. Do they still do that? They still bring out the tee? You're, um, what are you? And Morgan, you know Morgan's child's not old enough. They'll start him at three, though. Three years old, they'll start him on real baseball. I saw a banner for it. Real baseball, ages three to 18. Oh, really? That's, that's re literally what the sign said. Um, you're missing one thing, though. They Before they would take the tee away, they would bring out the coach and he would pitch, but he would pitch it to land on the tee and then they, you'd hit it. Right, So it was really about how good he was. Yeah, and he was always great. I don't want any more of this. I didn't like that with this. I think we're, get, we're getting closer to the original situation. Morgan, what sports do you want your child to play? Do you have anything in mind? No, that's you, right. no, no, you can't. Whatever you know, they want to play. That's, that's what right. every parent says, whatever they want to do, and then you realize they don't want to do anything. <laughs> and you have to make them do something. Esports. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Hockey because, because you still play the hockey. You still hockey it up. Mm. How many dads you got on the squad? Uh, I think they all are actually. You're, the, you're, the you're the last dad on the squad? Yeah. Did they call you boy? <laughs> oh, I like that. I like a cola and a burger together. And I've kind of, my tastes have adapted to a diet taste. Right. So that's this is the best so far for me. I think it's the best just because you're, it's used not as it. sweet. You're so used to it. That's, for me, Sprite is giving it a run for its money because it has, it has this tangy bite to it that goes with the sauce and the pickle. You gotta go back to the Sprite. But I'm going all the way to the Coke, which. Yeah, let me go know. there first. I mean, if you're ready for the sh sugar, I want to go to the middle of the. Yeah, go to the, go straight to the middle. If you're ready for the sugar, the Coke is better than the Diet Coke. Oh, oh, yeah, it <laughs> it's is. so good. Oh yeah, I just remembered why <clears throat> so many people drink this. What do you mean? 
What do you mean it can make me fat? <laughs> That's not true. It's liquid. It's like dark water. Yeah, I mean, it goes right through. I pee it right out. Uh, whoops. I'm teetering. Mm. I'm going back to the Sprite, but Coke is in the lead for me. There's so much special sauce on this particular Big Mac that I feel like I'm drinking special sauce. I'm and not that, complaining. And that, that's the real test because I think it's the liquid part of the burger that goes with the liquid part of your liquid. You're right, the Sprite is close. Sprite just moved ahead of diet. Now I'm down to Sprite and Coke. Excuse me. This is so pleasant. How many people eat and burp professionally on the internet? When people do those big mukbangs, do they just burp the whole time? Does that happen? Yeah, it's part of it. It's part of it? It's part of it. It's like built into the business model. I just hate. It's like, I, and now I just time hate for watching people. And now burp. time for a burp. Yeah. I'd rather watch somebody fart than burp because I can't see them farting. There's videos them. for that too. <laughs> you know what? There's on, on TikTok, there's a bunch of farting people. What? There's people who fart. I, and I don't know why they keep sending it to me. The for your page, my for you page. Bunch has of like, farters? Like there's a dude who wears a, he's a big dude who wears a very small Batman mask and he sits on the freaking toilet. He actually takes a crap in his TikToks. I'm like, why are you showing this to me? I hate this. <laughs> and then there's a grandpa. You seem to keep watching. No. It shows it to you because you watch it. There's a, there's a grandpa. That's why it works. There's a grandpa. It's an algorithm. Look, there's a grandpa who literally does this. His he does grandson even... <laughs> or somebody films him and he's standing in the kitchen and then he's got like a broom and he's like doing something. And then all of a sudden he just goes. <laughs> And it's like, does this walking fart standing in place? And it'll be like three clips of grandpa doing <laughs> And I don't want to watch it, but once you start watching an old man sit there and fart with the broom, you can't stop. That's different. It's, a, it's called a flatulist as a profession. It was actually big in France in the early 1900s. Yeah, there was a dude who could actually play music out of his bow. Yeah, his name was Le Pitoman. Yes. Yeah, yeah, I feel France. like we talked about him on the show at some point. Back, baby. We have, but we didn't. We didn't feel the need to keep talking about it. And this is coming from a guy who has farted on this show a couple of times. I farted once on this show. All right, I farted at least twice. Okay, final decision. I'm going to take one last. But they weren't intentional. On our vlogs, there was a moment when I, my fart was intentional for comedic effect. But I, I'd like to apologize for that. I'm sorry for intentionally farting. No, I'm not. Okay. But I, I mean, on the toilet, that that is too far. With a broomstick and a good dance, <laughs> that's that's welcome. Those are two different things. But I was kind of getting at, I kind of like watching, I don't like watching. I like watching someone fart more than I like watching somebody burp, because I can see where it's coming. It's, I just, burp. it's so Yeah, it's like happens. your eyes kind of cross, uh, and then your, your, your okay. cheek shake. Last chance, <laughs> or last decision. Uh, three, two, one, let's decide which one we like better. Is it gonna be the Sprite side or is it gonna be the Coke side? Three. Well, you've hidden the Sprite. Let's do this. Two. This, this is what you mean. One. Sprite. Coke, definitely. All right, I'm going with the Sprite. You know what? That's why they have a machine where you can pick one you want. Mm, you can mix them together if you want. I with a little bit of Coke in my Big Mac. Stay fresh all summer long with our good Mythical Summer Stay Fresh Tea, available now at mythical.com.